made to look professional by Mr. Luke Kane. And Mr. Dominic Gregory. Gregory! I said that with a really strong Gregory! Effect. <laughs> Mr. Dominic, Dominic Gregory! <laughs> So, Monday, busy as always, and we currently have lots of fun and games with our internet. Currently, we've been trying a few different options, and I think we've got a portable satellite outside at the moment, which is interesting. I don't know if it's down there. Hold on. Yeah, I'll show you. Look at that. Currently, just to see if it works, we've got it running off a car battery, it looks like and just a portable satellite outside. Hopefully if this works we'll actually be able to sort out our internet and make it work a bit better so that we can upload vlogs and other content much quicker. That's the aim of the game really. So, happy days. Who's the comfiest bear? There he is. What a comfy bear. Okay, so it is about... What time is it? Okay, coming up to half nine now, and I am still in the office in one of the packing rooms, as you can see. Thought I'd stay behind tonight and start helping out and get some other bits done and dusted so that everybody can start moving forward after the busy, busy weeks we've had with Black Friday and the run up to Christmas and everything else, and the fact that I've been off and so have a few others recently. So, trying to get everything pushed forward. I've been listening to my audiobooks, as you guys know I love to do. Um, I'm still listening to the um, Steve Jobs audiobook, which is actually really good. It is a hefty one. I don't like using these apps where it just kind of gives you a few bullet points. I like to actually listen to them and, and go through the entire book. And the Steve Jobs book that I'm listening to at the moment is a 25-hour book. And because I've been so busy, I haven't actually had that much time to listen to it. But for the past few hours, I have been listening to it, and it is amazing. For anyone who hasn't actually read or listened to it, go and check out Steve Jobs' biography, because it is awesome. Um, anyway, I'm going to keep doing this for a bit. It's probably going to be a fair few hours before I go home. Um, I'll be lucky to be home before midnight. Uh, but all in the name of getting shit done, right? Don, what are you thinking about? Uh, thinking of the name for your vlog. Yeah. And you look like you're thinking cloud. I'm thinking very hard. Can we, can we ask, our, ask the... Um, sorry, I love Christmas. Can we, uh, <laughs> can we ask our vlogging viewers of um, what they, what they should think we should name the vlog? Put it to a public vote. Why don't we make it into a competition? We could. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah? yeah. Competition. Yeah. We need a decent prize for it. <laughs> we're not giving that. We we're not giving that away. I also have one truffle left over. One you truffle. You get this right, you get this truffle. A solitary truffle. Uh huh. Uh huh. What? What should we give him? Something, something good. <laughs> a a photo shoot we've done. How about? Absolutely how about the slippers I just bought? One yeah, by you. Okay. Sweat included. <laughs> um, Have you still got any of your beard hair left? Mm. Oh, you can use it against a weave. We could like do Merry Christmas cards with them, with like the hair. <laughs> <laughs> I stick it on. Hundred mm. pound Amazon voucher. I'll have one. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You're going to want to buy oh. me a £100 Amazon voucher. Oh, £100 Amazon voucher. Yeah. yeah. You right. want as well, then. Yeah. Yeah. Team effort. For, for the winner oh. who successfully names... We need to set some criteria. Yeah, I feel like we, we're going to have to do this video again, but sure. All right. No, it's fine. We'll, we we'll do it. We have £100 Amazon voucher just for being winners in general. Mm -hmm. Winners in apply. Mm. Winners. You, all, winners. You, you definitely don't get one, then. <laughs> bah, humbug. <laughs> all right. Let's do let's do a com do that, a competition. We're gonna Woo! do a competition. Woo! Is that straight Right, so after speaking with Mr. Grady and the team down here, 
we have decided that we are going to do a competition for someone to name this vlog. So a few ground rules. The vlog is about me and my life uh, as an entrepreneur, the, the jobs that I do and things like that behind the scenes. So it has to be themed around uh, work, myself and, and everything else. So no beard stuff or lack thereof, uh, nothing else like that. Uh, we're trying to keep this like an entrepreneurial weekly vlog um, and my life as the person doing that. So try and come up with something to do with that. You can comment below on Facebook, YouTube, uh, anywhere. Send me direct messages, anyone can enter. And we will run this competition for one week until Monday. And the winner will get 100 pounds worth of Amazon vouchers. That's English pounds for any of you Americans out there. Not dollars, but hundred pounds to spend on whatever you want on Amazon.com that I will personally go out and purchase and give to the winner. So yeah, get comments and get thinking. Come up with something awesome, please. So I believe that Mr. Dominic is shooting a new product of ours, which would be our vanilla and sandalwood fragrance candle. Let's go find him. Oh, it's dark in here. Oh, it's very dark in here. Look at this. Here he is. Hello. Under, under cover of night. I like the dark. How's, how's it going? Good. I think it's scary in here. Spooky. Candles have been photographed. Oh, oh they look cool. Look alive. Yeah. Let's turn you guys around so you can see. Today is Wednesday morning, um, I am just heading to an event called Enterprise Plus. Enterprise Plus is an event that my accountant actually started and it is designed to kind of bring people together and help them move forward, help entrepreneurs move forward in their own learning and uh, in their own business. It's not quite a networking event, it's not quite a training seminar, it's some kind of hybrid-esque thing. Uh, so I haven't been for a while, they, they're actually on monthly and I've probably missed the past three, maybe four months because as you guys know I've been pretty hectic, uh, especially travelling. They always seem to be when I go away to different countries, which to be fair is quite a lot. Um, Anyway, uh, I'm heading down today because John, my accountant, has uh, got in touch and said, hey, guess what? I think you should come to this. I think it'll be useful for you. So I'm going to go find out what the hype's all about. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so I came in from my meeting today to find this on my desk, which says Slack Jaw Apparel on it. So I'm assuming it's from Slack Jaw Apparel. I don't know what it is. But recently I've been helping Tom, the owner of Slackjaw, do some marketing and in particular we've been doing social media marketing. We took his paid campaigns from a 2.1 return on investment up to a 14 times return on investment, which is fucking insane. So he's really happy about that and I think he sent me some goodies. Hopefully it's all PG, PG stuff. <laughs> Loads of... Loads of shirts and a beanie. Look what I have as my screen. So you got. What have you it's got? Tom. <laughs> it's Christmas Tom. Christmas Christmas Tom. It's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> you saw the states as well. Yeah. Yeah. Sick. Well, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be so so ghetto. Do I keep it like this? Yeah, keep it a bit daffy. Yeah, keep it a bit daffy. <laughs> over your over your shirt. No, shirt off. Slack jaw apparel. Send me big boy size. Cheech and chong. A flame haired cheech and chong. <laughs> I'm, I'm a fat Arthur Shelby, I told you. That's cool. Yeah, that's sick. Thank you, man. Right, check out 
Slack Draw Apparel, website here. Grady's over there, but he's already thinking. Website here. Mm -hmm. Website here. I got it. <laughs> All right. Tomorrow, I am doing an interview with Dean Lomax, who's a really good friend of mine and has built an awesome personal brand. So, because we're filming it, I'm going to go and get looked after, made to look professional by Mr. Luke Kane. And Mr. Dominic Gregory. Gregory! I said that with a really strong Gregory! <laughs> Mr. Dominic, Dominic Gregory! <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why it came out Scottish. Um, Mr. Dominic Gregory is going to take us down and we are going to try and get some content while we're there. And actually, we should be able to get... Oh, squeeze in. should be able to get us a fair bit of content. Obviously, we're going to do a bit for the personal brand. We're doing the, the vlogging right this second. Seat doing the vlogging right this second um, then we're heading down to no we're not heading anywhere uh, we're doing the, the vlog stuff when we're there we're going to be doing some more personal brand stuff some photography we're going to do some images around the hairstyles as well potentially some stuff around Volstead and many many other things so we're going to do a whole host of stuff so it should be a very very proactive afternoon Fingers crossed. Gregory getting ready to do some filming with his camera. Oh wait, no. His <laughs> Look at that beast. That's insane. Launcher thing. I can't, hold on, I can't get it in frame. Look <laughs> at the size that. That's ridiculous. It's not the size that counts, Dom. It's how you use it. Mm. This is true. We are about to start recording the first in a series of interviews that I'm doing for the personal brand and I brought Mr. Dean Lomax who is a long time friend, old training partner of mine. Liam Grady is so excited because Dean, tell them what you do. Tell them what you, I, I, I'm a paleontologist, I actually get a, a chance to travel around the globe digging up dinosaurs, describing new species of prehistoric life. It's, you know, I'm, I'm living my dream there, it's yeah. very epic. It, which is awesome. But who loves dinosaurs? Me! Grady loves dinosaurs. And actually, I brought with me a little present. A present for, for Grady? Yeah. Oh, yes, anyway, yeah. It's a little present. It's a piece of dinosaur bone. I collected whilst in America. It's my gift for you. It's like a Christmas present. I've got a ring! You've got your very own dinosaur. <laughs> what, what, do, what do we say? Marry me. <laughs> <laughs> Genuinely, Grady's, Grady's going to be so chuffed. I imagine this will be... I could say a lot worse, but it'll probably go on, on his mantelpiece. Yeah. <laughs> so, so what's it from? It's from uh, one of those sauropod dinosaurs, those long neck, long tail, something like Diplodocus. Okay. Yeah. It's wow. just a fragment. See, it's literally... Oh, you like, mean a Diplodocus? <laughs> oh, yeah. Let's, let's get into that later. <laughs> <laughs> Oh dear, silly times. So that is me done for the end of the day for the moment. I am going to be, we're going to nip to the gym and then I'm coming back because I've got a meeting in a bit. But we have finished the meeting with Dean. I think he's just coming here. Everyone else has gone. The meet in itself was absolutely amazing, so I really loved that. Um, and that will be online soon. I think Grady's gonna start editing some stuff tomorrow, but the actual content was insanely good. So you're gonna have to check that out because it went, it went well. Yeah, it went, right? it went well, yeah, really yeah, well. It was really good. Really yeah. Good. So we got some really valuable cool content in it. Um, but yeah, uh, go check Dean out. Grady's put his little link here um, for. Web, website, website, do you want? Oh, yeah, the, yeah, yeah, visit website, yeah. Website, the, Twitter, what, what do you want him to put up? Because it's going to go here. Okay, yeah, put the website up. <laughs> All right, there. okay, go. more content there about my career and stuff, so I think it'd be useful for anybody who's interested in not only paleontology, but, you know, my story and that, and learn a little bit more about me and, and you know, achieving, so. Yeah, so, yeah, go check that out. But, yeah, uh, yeah fucking awesome interview. Anyway, I'm going to go to the gym now, so. <laughs>